Hi there, my name is Ryan Malloy here at the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. In this video, we're going to discuss how to find the area of a triangle without knowing its height. So here we have a nasty looking triangle that has side lengths 3 centimeters, 6 centimeters, and 7 centimeters. And we're going to go ahead and label these sides. We'll say that this is A, blue side is B, and the yellow side is C. Cool. So we can compute the area directly from these three numbers without ever having to deal with angles or the height by using what's known as Heron's formula. With area is equal to S times S minus A times S minus B times S minus C. All this under a square root. We're here. S refers to the semi-perimeter of the triangle, or one half of the perimeter. In other words, it is A plus B plus C all over 2. So let's go ahead and plug in these numbers and see what we get. We have A is equal to 7 plus B is equal to 3 plus C is equal to 6 over 2. 7 plus 3 is 10, 10 plus 6 is 16, 16 divided by 2 is 8. So that's S. Okay, well, let's go ahead and continue this computation down here. And we'll plug in our numbers. We have 8 times 8 minus A, 7. times 8 minus B is 5. Times 8 minus C, which is 6. Great. So let's try and simplify this a little bit. This is equal to square root of 8 times 1 times 3 times 2. 2 times 3 is 6. 6 times 8 is 48. This is equal to the square root of 48, which we can recombine to the square root of 4 times 4 times 3. Square root of 4 is 2. We can pull that out. This square root of 4 is 2 also. It becomes 2 times 2 times square root of 3, which is equal to 4 root 3. And of course, this is in square centimeters. And there we have it. Once again, my name is Ryan Malloy, and we've just discussed how to find the area of a triangle without using its height.